Hello everybody, this is Machine Safe, and this is Let's Play Legend Zelda Ocarina of Time. In the last episode, I believe we actually finished uh, the Ward's Temple and got Fire Arrows. And in this episode, we're going to Kakariko Village. Who cooked their pasta for too long? Seriously. Honestly, just. I bet it's Mario. I bet it's Talon. I bet he cooked his pasta for way too long. Honestly. Oh, Sheik! Awesome! Sheik will save everybody! Get back! Link! That doesn't look good. Um, Sheik? Okay, Sheik's gone. The whole world's doomed. If Sheik even got destroyed, nobody can destroy that thing. I knew TV fuzziness was evil. <laughs> That's why everybody should tune their TVs in properly and not just leave it fuzzy. Honestly. It's raining, no more fire. Ah, Sheik's alright. And now we're alright. Looks like you're coming around. Link, a terrible thing has happened. The evil shadow spirit has been released. Impa, the leader of the Kakariko village, had sealed up the evil shadow spirit in the bottom of the well. But the force of the evil spirit got so strong, the seal of the well broke, and it escaped into the world. Well I believe Impa has gone to the Shadow Temple to seal it again, but she will be in danger without any help. Link, Impa is one of the six sages. Destroy the evil spi Shadow Spirit and save Impa. There is an entrance to the Shadow Temple beneath the graveyard, behind this village. The only thing I can do for you is teach you the melody that will lead you to the Shadow Temple. This is the melody that will draw you into the infinite darkness that absorbs even time. Listen to this, the Nocturne of Shadow. You have learned the Nocturne of Shadow. Let me take care of the village. I'm counting on you, Link. I think the Nocturne of Shadow really does fit the whole uh, darkness, evil sort of theme. Because it it's just so sad and, um, well, dark, really. I mean, just listen to it. I'm not going to play it myself, but I can't even remember it. But, uh, where is it? No, that's not it. That's Serenade of Water. <laughs> oh, I can't even tell which one's which. I just really like that song. It just fits so well. But, um... Now, I'm going to the graveyard, not because Sheik wants me to, because uh, there's a different thing we can do here. 
and if we wanted to get to the Shadow Temple, you'd have to play the song. There's no way to get it to a, get to it otherwise, unless you, I don't know, cheat or something. Something stupid like that, really. But, um, if you come down here, if you remember right, this is Dompey's grave. Now we've got the long shot, we can finally race him again. Hehehe, <laughs> young man, are you fast on your feet? I may not look it, but I'm confident in my speed. Let's have a race. Follow me if you dare. So, we're now chasing Dompe. Ah, <laughs> uh, fire, fire. Be careful of the fire, because um, that will slow you down. And because this is the second race, you really cannot afford to be slowed down by this. Ah, uh, oh, oh. Uh, that's, when I practiced this, I didn't once get hindered by fire. Um, oh, damn, 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 wrong way, wrong way, wrong way. Oh, good, just made it, just made it. If you see a rupee, it means go the other way, basically. Oh, finally caught up with Dompe, good. <laughs> oh, I really don't like this area anymore, because you hear re-deads, and I think just hearing them... Yeah, I am going this way, it's a, it's a bit of a shortcut, not really, but... Uh, but just hearing the Redeads is a lot scarier than seeing them. It, and just unknown passages. It, it, it's actually quite scary, really. Uh, uh, so just fire the shot at... Well, long shot, I should say, at the torch. And... Ah, oh, 59 seconds. I got 55 last time. But um, as long as you win the race, it's not doable unless you use the long shot, by the way. Time in this race was 59 seconds. You're back, young man. Was the present I gave to you fun and useful? So, he gives you a piece of heart. So if I collect two pieces, and um, now the next thing we can do is Young Link. Um, oh, that. Oh, seven five gone scorchers. Of course, I haven't got one since last episode. But um, play these. Um, Light song, whatever it's called. Prelude of light, that's it. Warp. Oh no, I can't warp here! Oh dear. Never mind, I guess I'll have to go to the windmill and warp there instead. But, um, yeah, the. Um, you want to be Young Link now, so play, play the Prelude of Light to get back to the. Um, back to being Young Link. Being t well, Temple of Time and then uh, back to Young Link. No, right. Ah. What the? There we go. <laughs> I was playing it completely wrong just then. Hopefully I should be able to warp here. Yeah, here we go. So, um, I shall meet you outside of the Temple of Time as Young Link. Or wherever I warp to, if I warp somewhere. Okay, I am now in Lake Hylia. And, um... As young Link, you want it to be night time, as there is a gone school shot, and I was about to go the... Why? No, I was about to go the right way. Stupid of me. Um, be careful, there is Ox Rocks in the water as young Link, day or night. And, of course, be careful of the crows. Gabor, okay, Gabor, okay, don't talk to me! Good. I don't even know what he does there. I just ignore him every time I go past him. Honestly, if you want to talk to him, talk to him, but I'm... Um, I'm not in the mood to hear his stupidity. But, there's a golden sculpture here, can I just get it? Oh, you annoying cuckoo. That cuckoo will pay for that. I was just about to get it as well. Um, it takes two hits with the boomerang anyway, so I want about time. But, um, watch it appear. It just grows from nothingness. <laughs> oh, I still hit it, wow. I thought I'd it easily missed. I don't know why they don't just make it so you can lock onto the golden sculptures. I really don't know why they didn't make it like that. But, now you've done that, you want to go to um, Zora's River. I'm just going to take the shortcut with, um, it, uh, into Zora's Domain, but I shall meet you near the frogs. Okay, I'm now over here near the frogs, so, come here, and I believe I know the song of time, I'm just going to make sure. Yep, okay, I was right. So, as you see, there is only one... 
one frog left, and if you play the Song of Time, it shall grow up, probably. <laughs> I'm assuming it's this one. Yep, it is. Young lad, you played the ocarina well. Mm, that melody is so fine. Ribbit. We all should practice it. Ribbit. Take rupees as your a souvenir. If you come up with another nice melody, please drop by and play it. Ribbit. Ribbit. So we just get rupees for that. But, ah, oh, no, no, no. I always do that. <laughs> Those bombs are dangerous. If you play the song, song of Storms, you shall get an... Uh, well, just see for yourself. Wow, that melody is so cool. Look it. Singing in the rain. Oh, what a feeling. Look it. Please take this as a token of our froggish gratitude. Look it. All right, see you. Look it. So you get a heart piece. Now you've collected three pieces. With another piece, your life energy will be powered up. Okay. I'm not sure whether I've just screwed myself. Look at us. We're all huge frogs. We're the world famous fabulous five froggish tenors. Rebbit. No, I haven't. Never mind. I honestly thought that you had to play it in a different order. Because there's a second heart piece you can get from these frogs. Okay, sorry about that. I just uh, got interrupted for a second. Make us jump so we can eat the bugs flying above us. Rebbit. Okay, then ready, set, go! Okay, um, this is a... Uh, oh! Okay, this is very confusing. I'll just go through which frog is which. The blue one with the bug hovering over now is A. Oh, come on! Okay, blue one, uh, at the very front is A. The purple one just behind is left C. The grey one above is up C. The red one is right C. And the yellow one is down C. So you need to follow the, um, well, where the bug goes, basically. And it's quite annoying. Okay. Um, why is it doing... It did the exact same pattern as on my pra practice profile. Okay, okay. You'll probably struggle with it a bit more than I did, but that did the exact same pattern as on my pro practice profile, so I already knew that. That's weird. I, why didn't he do a different... Whatever, I'm not complaining. I, I managed to do it easily. <laughs> Young boy, you did great. Perfect. We are stuck with it. Would you take this token of our free gratitude? So, you get another piece of heart. You've completed another heart container. So now I've got, um, 16? No, 17. We've got 17 heart containers now. Um, so, yeah. Very good. Um, only... Is it only four more pieces of... Yeah. For each... Uh, for both of them dungeons, we'll get a heart container. There's only four more heart pieces in the entire game. Wow. <laughs> uh, for Golden Sculptures, so as Domain still remains, we will get the dungeon item next dungeon for that... to get that Golden Sculpture. Curry Forest, done. Uh, Lost Woods, done. Kriko Village, done. Wait, is it? Meh, okay. Uh, it's just the, the well that you saw is a dungeon in itself. And I'm, there is three golden sculptures there, so that's shocking. It doesn't actually count them, three golden sculptures. Death Mountain, done. Hyrule Field, done. Market. Well, that counts uh, Ganon's Castle. And Ganon's Castle has a total of one golden sculpture. Long the Ranch, done. Hylia, Hylia Lakeside. Lake Hylia, basically. Done. Gerudo Cap Valley, not done, but we haven't been there. And Gerudo's Fortress, we haven't even heard of that place yet. As you see, it's not on the mini-map. So, um, yeah, not done, of course. But I know this episode is going to be a bit shorter than last episode's, but I think it's about time we had a slight, slightly shorter one. So, I bid you all farewell. Bye. <laughs>